Welcome to the Humane Society for Greater Nashua. We were founded in the year 1900 by Miss Jenny Kendall, originally to serve women, children, and horses. In 1930, local businessman Roscoe Proctor generously donated his land to be used as the Proctor Pet Cemetery, the first pet cemetery in New Hampshire. Let's head into our clinic. Our low-cost veterinary clinic offers veterinary services for owned pets in our community. We are proud to offer weekly low-cost clinics. We offer low-cost vaccine clinics as well as low-cost spay and neuter clinics. We are so proud to offer these services to pet owners in our community. Our full-time veterinarian also treats the animals in our care. All animals are spayed or neutered and up to date on their vaccinations, as well as microchipped before they are put up for adoption. Let's walk through the lobby and head into one of our cat rooms. This is one of our three cat rooms. Each cat gets a spacious kennel with separate areas, one with their bedding, food and water, and another where their litter box is. Each one of our cat kennels has one of these hidey beds. It allows the cats to do their two favorite things, hide underneath or perch on top. Now let's check out our community cat room, the second of our three cat rooms. In this room, cats are able to free roam, have plenty of space to climb, hide, sleep, and play, or perch by the window. Each of the cats and small animals at our shelter are given ample social, mental, and physical stimulation every day. This is not considered an extra at our shelter, but instead part of the enrichment protocol that is necessary for companion animals. This is the cat preparation room where staff and volunteers wash dishes, prepare cat food, and store all necessary cat care supplies. Our small animals, such as bunnies, guinea pigs, mice, and birds, are kept in this hallway and sometimes in our lobby. Here we have a bonded pair of guinea pigs, Stewie and Louie. A bonded pair means that they have formed a strong friendship and they must go home together. Let's check out the French Quarter. Often used as our third cat room, but currently we have a bunny, Penelope, using it to stretch her legs. Now let's head into our dog room. This is our dog preparation area. This is where staff and volunteers do dishes, prepare dogs food, and store needed supplies to care for the dogs. Each kennel is cleaned every single day to ensure that the dogs are living in the cleanest, safest, and healthiest areas. Our dog room has three hallways. The first is our pound where we keep and care for lost pets while we help them find their families. The second is our quarantine hallway where we keep and care for animals while we prepare them for adoption. And the third is our adoption hallway, 
where we keep and care for our adoptable animals and help them find their forever families. Let's head behind the scenes where we store necessary supplies. This is where we store donations of laundry detergent, cleaning supplies, linens, bedding, and all of the items that we need to care for the animals. Did you know that our dedicated staff and volunteers do at least eight loads of laundry every single day? Let's head into our pet pantry. This is a part of our safety net program. Pet owners in our community can come to our shelter and receive necessary pet food and supplies to continue to provide the best possible care for their pets. Along with the pet supplies we keep on hand in the shelter, we have volunteers who distribute pet food and supplies to local food pantries to make it more accessible to pet owners in our community. Our shelter sits on six acres of land, much of which is dedicated to several walking trails. Our dogs are given at minimum four walks every single day. Now let's check out our training center. Our certified trainer and staff work with the animals in our care to ensure that they have their training needs met. In addition, we provide training classes for owned pets in our community. Along with at least four walks every day, our dogs are given playtime and enrichment time outside in our play yards or in our training center. Our volunteer program provides a fulfilling experience for all age groups, including those in school who need service hours and custom projects. Every year, several thousand pets are adopted from our Humane Care Center. In addition, 2,500 animals receive medical care here every single year. We provide shelter for 1,650 stray or unwanted animals. And through our transport partnerships, we have saved the lives of over 6,500 dogs.